Hello, this is another video brought to you by FlipWebsites.com and in today's video you're going to learn how to use Flippa's tags effectively as a website seller. For those of you not familiar with Flippa's tagging system, it simply allows sellers to use keywords or tags to describe their auction listings. For example, if you're selling a WordPress site, you might use the tag WordPress to describe your listing. In turn, the system allows buyers to search and follow listings by tags. It's important that as a website seller, you know how best to take advantage of their tagging system. And this video will outline how to get the most of it as a seller of existing websites and as a seller of startup websites. So let's first talk about using tags effectively as a seller of existing websites. If you're selling an existing website, it's important you know what tags to use to describe your listing so you get it in front of as many buyers as possible. You're only allowed three tags, so you want to choose them wisely. What you're going to do is visit the tags list on Flippa and sort it by buyers watching. And this will sort the list by the tags most watched or most desired by buyers. So let's go take a look at that. So here I am at Flippa, and I'm at the listing or the tags uh, listings. And it's flippa.com slash listing dash tags. And what you're going to do, let's just bring this up here. What you're going to do is just click on this buyer's watching link. And what this does is it sorts the tags by the um, buyers, uh, by the most buyers watching these tags. So for example, e-commerce has 35 buyers watching it uh, or watching that, that, uh, that particular tag. And as you can see here, it goes in, in descending order. So let's say you are selling an established uh, stop smoking WordPress blog. So what you're going to do is you'll start at the top of the list and work your way down, and you're going to select the top three most watched tags that fit your listing. So looking at this tags list, I would choose, obviously, WordPress, um, health, because stop smoking is you know health related and established those are the three um, most watched tags that fit my particular listing so you would use again WordPress health and established now you might be tempted because you know you might think stop smoking is a is a hot niche and it is and you might be tempted to to put stop smoking um, as a tag. Well, you wouldn't do that because as you can see here, looking through this list, and again concentrating on this buyer's column, which again is sorted, stop smoking is not listed anywhere. Okay, So nobody is really looking for that particular tag. So if you use that, it would be a complete waste because it, it just nobody is looking for it. So that's why you want to stick with the tags that people are currently watching. And don't try to reinvent the wheel and try to come up with something else and, and try to create some kind of following that isn't there um, already. Now let's turn our direction to using tags effectively as a seller of startup websites. If you build websites to flip immediately, then it's important that you know what types of websites buyers are looking for today. Now by now it should be obvious how the tags list sorted by buyers watching again can help, but just in case it isn't, let me show you how. So what this tags list is, is basically, again, especially if you sort it by buyers watching, is it's just a snapshot of the types of websites buyers are looking for right now. And so if you look at this, and all you got to do is start at the top and work your way down, these are obvious clues as to what types of websites you should be building as a uh, website flipper, a short-term website flipper, um, in order to you know to get the most sales and to get the most money. Um, so right now, e-commerce, WordPress sites, auto blogs, AdSense sites, ClickBank ready sites, health-related websites, drop shipping uh, websites, which is kind of tied into e-commerce, uh, Twitter-related websites, established websites, ClickBank websites, and on and on. So all you got to do is just take a look at this. And so a home run website to sell would be a e-commerce site built on a WordPress platform. If you could combine those two, you'd be striking gold because uh, as you can see here, those types of sites are in very high demand right now. 
So hopefully this video has showed you how the tagging system on Flippa can be uh, very helpful for you if you know how to use it effectively. And again, uh, just bookmark this, uh, this tags list and use it every time you list an existing website for sale and reference it regularly if you are a startup website flipper um, as it'll give you some clues as to what buyers are looking for today. For more great information like this and, and tips on website flipping, be sure to visit flipwebsites.com.